This display shows the SIMS Climate Digest for April 2015, featuring highlights from the U.S. and global analysis products issued each month by NOAA's National Climatic Data Center. The Climate Digest conveys a visual interpretation of recent weather and climate conditions worldwide. Warmer than average temperatures were experienced throughout most of the world, with the exception of Australia, Southern Asia, Central Africa, and the North Atlantic, where cooler than normal conditions moderated the global warmth. For April 2015, the combined average global land and ocean temperature was 1.33 degrees Fahrenheit, 0.74 Celsius higher than the 20th century average. This was the fourth highest for April in the 136-year period of record, but also the lowest monthly departure from average since November 2014. In Scandinavia, some locations in Finland observed temperatures 3.6 degrees Fahrenheit above average. Sweden and Norway also experienced warmer than normal temperatures, where most notably in Sweden, the Torna River was ice-free on April 26, 2015. This marks the third earliest ice breakup on record for the extensive river. Spain's average temperature was 3.1 degrees Fahrenheit warmer than average during the month of April. Similar to the global average, Spain experienced their fourth warmest April on record since records began. In the United States, temperatures were above normal nearly everywhere, and much above normal in the southeast. The state of Florida had its warmest April on record at 6.1 degrees Fahrenheit above the 20th century average. Alabama and Georgia also had record-breaking temperatures during April. Nationally, the average temperature for April was 2.1 degrees Fahrenheit above the 20th century average. This makes April 2015 the 17th warmest April on record for the contiguous United States. The lower 48 ranked in the wettest third of the historical record for April. However, drought conditions worsened across parts of the Northwest, Northern Plains, and Upper Midwest. Exceptional drought persisted in the West. According to the U.S. Drought Monitor, 37.4% of the contiguous United States was in drought at the end of April. Moving to South America, Argentina had warmer-than-average conditions across much of the country. Some locations recorded their warmest April since records began more than a half century ago. Over in Australia, temperatures were cooler than normal in April, with the mean temperature at 1.22 degrees Fahrenheit, 0.68 Celsius below normal, making it the 29th lowest on record. Nationally, Australia was wetter than normal. New South Wales, for instance, had its 11th wettest April on record, with precipitation totals coming in at 47% above normal. In contrast, Tasmania had its fifth driest April on record. With temperature readings of 9 degrees Fahrenheit, 5 Celsius, above normal, Russia was a major contributor to the warmer-than-average global land and ocean temperatures in April. This real-time data set shows sea surface temperature anomalies for April measured by NOAA satellites. Blue colors indicate cooler than normal ocean temperatures, and red indicate warmer than normal ocean temperatures. According to NOAA Climate Prediction Center, weak to moderate El Nino conditions were present during April 2015. There's a 90% chance that these El Nino conditions will continue through the Northern Hemisphere summer, and more than an 80% chance it will last through 2015. This real-time data set collected by microwave sensors on NOAA satellites shows snow and ice cover updated daily. Watch the progression of days and note the retreat and expansion of the snowfall. The April sea ice extent for the Arctic was 5.5% below the 1981-2010 average, which is the second smallest April sea ice extent since satellite records began in 1979. Finally, we'll move to the Antarctic, where April 2015 was 22.4% above the 1981-2010 average, the largest sea ice extent on record for the month of April. And that's your April 2015 Climate Digest. For more information, please visit the website shown at the end of this video.